Hello, Roman Budak. Going to be demonstrating the new ADK for the BLE Solution NXP Personal Health Group, the NXH 3670. There's the board. We're going to be running the software on it as well, so we've got the computer showing that. It also requires a dongle, which we'll be plugging into the PC. The dongle has the BLE chip on one side, talking to the ADK board. As the output, I'll be using some speakers so that we can hear the sound quality out of the unit. And on my PC, what I've pulled up is the playlist songs that we'll be playing. Device manager, so I can see when the device joins. And then also the default sound. So what I've done ahead of time is I've already defined it to be default. When I plug in my dongle, you'll see it become the default audio source. However, if you don't have that on yours, you would have to right click on it. So to get started, uh, what we will do, oh, a little description of the board. And so here's our board. This is the volume control. This is the song select. I've plugged in the micro USB cable for charging. Audio output cable here. So again, this will be volume and song select because it acts as a headset. Uh, programming cable and so forth we won't touch on the device. So let's set the board down, and I will now plug in the dongle. So this dongle over here, I plugged it into the USB port of the computer. And what we'll see is we will see that it recognizes on my device manager. So let's pull up that screen. And under sound and audio, I should see a unit that pops up that says wireless headset. On my default audio, what I've also done is I can see that it says the headphone selection. And what I did ahead of time is, again, I right-clicked on the device and set it to be default. That way, anytime I plug in the dongle, it becomes the default. Now, to play some music... I will look at the dongle, or I'm sorry, the headset unit, and I press the button twice. And I could see the blue light momentarily blink. That meant it made uh, connection with my dongle. My speakers clicked. So I have a connection. There's a rechargeable battery on the back, which again, I've charged with the micro USB connector. So let's play some music. Just the volume with this one. And the song is playing. I can see if I click this, I can rotate to a different song. Very good audio quality coming out. Nice response. Now I've been happy lately, thinking about the good things to come, and I believe it could be something good has begun. Oh, I've been smiling lately. If for some reason the dongle gets disconnected, the headphone board will turn to blue, so I'll demonstrate that here. I'll show the board here. If I pull the dongle out, eventually the blue light blinks. The audio is coming out of my laptop. As long as the board is up, I don't have to press the button twice. I could just plug the dongle back in and eventually it'll make a connection. I saw it pop up on my uh, board here i see it pop up as a device and then eventually it'll pair and start playing music again so it took a couple seconds but it's playing music again any other questions let me know